Okay. Hi, welcome back. My name is Heather. This is my channel. It's, uh, made with love. I just wanted to do a quick introductory video as to a little bit about myself. And kind of like what I want to do with this channel. So, my name is Heather. I'm 42. I've got a married to a wonderful man. We've been together 12 years. In February, we'll be celebrating our 8th wedding anniversary. I have four kids from my first marriage. They're not little kids anymore. They're 19, 18, 15, and 13. I'm a stay-at-home mom. I've been, I also run a small day home through my, in my home. I've been doing that for eight years now. Uh, things I things I like to do is I love to, I like to cross stitch. I love to make lots of quick, easy home decor, crafting ideas with the kids. I do lots of cooking and baking on an extremely tight budget. I can say in previous years I've had years where you know making a can't stop. making a meal for a family of six. When you've got like four or five hundred dollars for the whole month for all groceries, you do three meals a day, seven days a week, six people. So I found some really fast, effective ways. And I really like to share my ideas on that. I also know how to budget, like household budgets, how to actually, you know, I always feel like my kids didn't get to do a lot of things. I didn't have a lot of extra money, but... I find ways around that where my kids don't mind. They didn't get to go into like paid sports, but some of those other like dancing and figure skating and hockey, football, lacrosse, anything else that their friends were into. But we found other ways to, you know, to so they could still get to do those things without costing like a lot of money and spending a lot of time transporting you know, to games and stuff, and I didn't drive for a long time, so having kids and not driving means there's lots of other things I, my kids couldn't do, but I have some of the stuff I really love, like I said, like, I love to cook, I love to bake, I've been told over the years, because every time one of my kids has a birthday, I do an elaborate birthday cake, we go search online, we go on Pinterest, I've got cookbooks, and they'll go through the cookbooks or the ideas and we will make them. I have done Spongebob, Pokemon, Dora, Disney princesses. The last ones I did was the Frozen. I did her whole big three level Frozen cake. Um, with the base of the cake looking like a lake. So it was actually the cake was actually made on a bed of Jello. Uh, so see, I've done the Shopkins. I think my hardest one I ever made was for my oldest daughter and she was really into Doctor Who. I made the TARDIS and my house was just so hot that the cake just kept, the TARDIS kept tipping over. I'm gonna drop my camera there. So my cake, the, the TARDIS was on top of the cake and it kept tipping over and it slanted to the one side. So I actually turned, so I actually added some more, a little bit of icing onto the one side and made it look like the TARDIS was actually either coming into or you know, coming through the cake. Uh, so, I don't know, I've just done so many things. I you know, love to, so, like, seasonal decor. I change out everything in my house every month. I change out for the seasons. Um, right now, we just had Thanksgiving, so my table, my, my formal living, formal dining room table is set up for fall. In the next, uh, week or so I'll be taking all that down and I'll be decorating for Christmas so I will be doing the video for when I'm doing that because I'll change up my tablecloths, the runners, the placemats, napkins, the whole table set, all the dishes, silverware, everything gets changed from every season so it's like every four to six weeks I'm totally changing my dining room table. Same with like my china cabinet, I pull everything out, I switch for the seasons. Um, I've got my little displays I do all throughout my house. They change for the seasons. My day home, of course, I change that monthly for all the different seasons. And if the if the month doesn't have a specific season, it's still like, you know, part of the winter, spring, summer, autumn theme stuff. Uh, let's see, I think that's about it. Oh, you see, yeah, like I do, I'm learning to sew. 
So I have a sewing machine. I don't have a sewing table, so my sewing machine's not up here yet. I've got a stack of stuff that's all pinned, ready to be sewn, that I've been working on for years that I haven't gotten to. I love to cross stitch. I've been doing that for almost 30 years. I've done the rug hooking. I've got a big one I started about five years ago. I'm almost finished. It's a big Care Bear. Um, a couple things I want to learn to do is I want to learn crocheting and knitting. I've tried knitting and I can get the to go on the first, get my first line done and then when I go to switch out to get to the second line, as soon as I take out the, the um, knitting needle, my whole thing just always seems to unravel and fall apart. I've never done the crocheting. But I have tried the macrame and people always tell me that crocheting is pretty simple. It's, sim it's sort of pretty similar to the macrame. So that I will be trying pretty soon as well. And I'd like to, you know, do some videos, tutorials, like getting started. How do you start? Like, you know, just never done this before. It'd be interesting to see, you know, I've got my books. I've got these beginner books that I bought for the kids on how to knit that they had no interest in doing or they wanted to learn, they read the books and they kind of gave up. So I'll be using those beginner books to see what I can do, see if I can actually get it to work. Um, so that's a bit about, about myself and kind of what I want to do with this channel. I'm also creating, I'm in the process of creating a daily blog that will also be called Made With Love. And it's going to be like a daily up to date to go along with this channel is for the crafts and stuff and projects I'm working on for here. So some some projects will take multiple days. So if I can do quick updates daily on there, I will be getting that um, up pretty soon. Hopefully by the end of this week, I'll have like by this weekend for sure. I should have my blog up. Uh, I've also just bought myself the new camera. I'm just trying to figure out how it works. I'm having lots of troubles with my phone not connecting to my laptop right now and then having trouble just downloading all this stuff and then trying to get my laptop to hook into um, YouTube. We are kept, our internet keeps cutting out and just just makes it very hard to try to download when you know when all the kids are home on their electronics right now and I'm trying to upload and download and the kids are all doing their stuff just not enough, not in strong enough bandwidth, I guess, our problem is. But yeah, so I hope everybody will really enjoy my channel and please subscribe and I'll give more details as when I get my blog set up as to where exactly you'll be able to find that because I'm not quite sure where it's, I just know it's going to be called Made With Love. Same with this channel, just Made With Love. And I hope everybody enjoys everything that I make and all my tips I have. Okay, thank you. Bye.